Author Tom Hartman said, New stories are necessary to change the world. Energy should be news February 2013. News about us. We've reached an important milestone with 2,000 views of our various videos and 300 just in February alone, and our most watched video continues to be to allow lots of renewables, baseload coal and nuclear must go. Electricity. Australia hops to wind. Declining costs of wind combined with a carbon fee imposed last year makes wind the best deal in Australia by a lot. Wind electricity is much cheaper now than coal and natural gas. This inflatable solar collector starts soft like a kiddie swimming pool until you inflate it. Then it's lightweight and low cost. Why is U.S. residential solar so much more expensive than German solar? The Lawrence Berkeley National Laboratory updated and expanded an earlier study. The conclusion remains the same. It's not the costs of the panels or the inverter. It's the soft costs of customer acquisition, permitting, and paperwork. Transportation. The best motorcycle for police work might just be electric, particularly in urban and park settings. Very stealthy and quiet, quick, low fuel and maintenance costs, and a 120 mile range that's plenty for many kinds of police work. Big Brown is going green. They're purchasing 100 electric vehicles to put into service in Central California. Electric vehicles, of course, are quick and quiet. There are large savings from not having to buy diesel fuel and very little maintenance. And since UPS knows the delivery route in advance, the 75 mile range is no problem for UPS and many other vehicle fleet owners. And if they happen to have a route that needs more than 75 miles, they just send one of the old diesels. U.S. families spent $3,000 on transportation fuel last year. That's the highest percentage of household income spent on fuel in almost 30 years. And though it's not part of this study, common plug-ins charge about a quarter the cost of historically, that is to say fossil, fueled vehicles. But that kind of savings on fuel, combined with EVs being quick, fun to drive, and low maintenance costs, may point to rapid growth for plug-in vehicles. Researchers in Utah are developing ways to wirelessly transfer large amounts of electricity to buses and cars across a 10-inch air gap with high efficiency. Miscellaneous. Simply lift a bag of dirt every 20 to 30 minutes and you've got light. This crowdfunded company's goal is to deliver gravity lights to end users at $10 each within very few months. And $10 is less than the cost of three months of kerosene for many people. In Germany, at night, there is often very cheap excess electricity on the grid from wind and too much baseload generation. Audi is developing a factory to take that electricity and convert it to methane, storing that energy for later use. The process is expected to be 40% efficient at the start and increase to as much as 60% efficiency in the future. Although this is inefficient in comparison to electricity stored in a battery, the cost of electricity late at night can be very low. In fact, Baseload generators in Europe sometimes end up paying others to take their excess. Please subscribe to our free monthly newsletter, visit us on the web, or visit us on YouTube, Facebook, or LinkedIn. And your donations help us make more videos more quickly. Thank you.